It looks like Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's latest attempt to solidify their iconic status through another dramatic black and white photo shoot has hit a major roadblock. London's prestigious National Portrait Gallery has officially rejected their portrait, leaving the Sussexes stunned. You heard that right. The royal duo, who seem to believe every snapshot of their lives is museum-worthy, just got a cold, hard rejection slip. The portrait, taken by their close friend Miss and Harriman just months after they dramatically exited royal life, was supposedly destined for the gallery's permanent collection. But here's the kicker. The gallery had other plans. Instead of gracing the esteemed walls of London's National Portrait Gallery, the photo is now gathering dust and storage, tucked away from public view. Of course, in true Sussex fashion, their pal Misson proudly declared that his portrait was part of the gallery's permanent collection, gushing on social media about how humbled and proud he was. No doubt, he expected a wave of applause from the Sussex squad. But reality quickly set in when the gallery made it crystal clear. The portrait may have been acquired, but it won't be on display anytime soon. In fact, it might never see the light of day. Ouch! The Sussexes, who seem to live life through an Instagram filter, thought they'd be taking their place among iconic figures in the art world. Instead, this is yet another reminder that not every moment in their lives is destined for historical significance. It seems their relentless pursuit of self-importance has fallen flat again. And let's not forget Miss and Harriman, who, like his royal pals, has a tendency to exaggerate his achievements. Earlier this year, in May 2024, he was hyping up his work, claiming the portrait of Harry and Meghan was part of the gallery's collection. But acquiring a photo doesn't mean it's going on display, Missin. It's more like a maybe someday, but not likely. His overblown announcement is just another Sussex PR fail, one that's left fans rolling their eyes. Now, as you'd expect, when things go wrong for Harry and Meghan, their hardcore supporters need someone to blame. This time, they're pointing fingers at none other than the Princess of Wales, Catherine, claiming she blocked the portrait from being displayed. Yes, you heard that right. The Sussex squad is launching conspiracy theories, desperately trying to divert attention from the simple truth. The portrait just didn't make the cut. This isn't just a loss for Miss and Harriman but another misstep for Harry and Meghan in their ongoing attempt to stay relevant. Their efforts to push their brand and maintain their place in the public, I have once again fallen flat. The world isn't always buying what the Sussexes are selling, and this latest episode is proof of that. So, what's next for the Royal Rebels? Maybe it's time for Harry and Meghan to take a step back and realize that not every black and white portrait is worthy of a museum. The National Portrait Gallery has spoken. And let's just say, the verdict isn't exactly flattering. Want to stay on top of all the latest royal drama? Make sure to subscribe to Fame Finder. Don't forget to like the video and drop a comment below with your thoughts. The royal roller coaster is far from over, and we've got plenty more juicy stories coming your way.